The cleanliness of your sieves is important to the accuracy of your lab's test results as well as to avoid cross-contamination of samples. These delicate precision instruments require special handling to ensure a reasonable life of service. The manner of cleaning and handling varies with each style of testing sieve. Metal frame sieves, for example, will have different guidelines from the 3 inch acrylic L3 sieves and the precision line sieves. To clean your woven wire cloth metal frame test sieve, start by gently brushing from the bottom side only. To avoid distorting the apertures, never use a sharp object to clear a blockage. Sieves may be washed in a solution of mild detergent and warm water. Use of solvents, acids, and other cleaning agents is not recommended. For a more thorough cleaning, an ultrasonic cleaner may be used. Be sure to refer to your ultrasonic manufacturer instructions, as some devices may cause screen damage. Be aware that exposure to temperatures above 261 degrees Fahrenheit may cause the wire cloth to distort and loosen as the solder will begin to soften at this point. Do not use forced air on number 100 or finer wire cloth. Screen damage may result. Always store your test sieves in a clean, dry environment. When cleaning your acrylic sonic sifter woven wire cloth sieves, start by gently brushing the mesh from the underside only. Again, never use a sharp object to clear blinded areas. You may wash them in a mild solution of detergent and warm water. Use of solvents, acids, or other cleaning agents is not recommended. Do not use forced air on number 100 or finer wire cloth as screen damage may result. Always store your test sieves in a clean, dry environment. Electroformed nickel mesh test sieves are extremely fragile and require very special handling. Long service life can be obtained by observing the following guidelines. Sample sizes should never exceed 2 grams by mass or 4 cc's by volume. Use only a single precision sieve in your test stack at a time when performing separations at 30 microns or finer. Always be sure to set your sonic sifter amplitude to zero before beginning your test. Gradually increase the amplitude until the test media lifts a maximum height of one quarter inch above the screen surface. Never touch the sieve mesh with your fingers or any objects other than your sample. Acids in your perspiration will permanently stain or damage the mesh. Never use a brush or forced air to clean precision mesh. Never expose your precision sieve to radiant energy or temperatures above 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Your precision sieve may be washed in a solution of mild detergent and water. When cleaning, hold the sieve in the vertical position and gently rinse with distilled water only. Allow to air dry. The use of ultrasonic, mechanical cleaners, or any other cleaning method is not recommended. Always store your precision test sieve in the original protective box in a clean, dry environment. Test sieves treated with the correct use, handling, and care will reward you with a long service life. For additional Advantech manufacturing product and instructional videos, please visit our website at advantechmfg.com.